okay so today i will be discussing about the subtypes in infotype so here i have taken an employee so the infotype which contains subtype uh, for example is uh, address so the subtypes here are these are the subtypes this is the code of the subtype this is the description of the subtype one is permanent two is temporary residence four emergency address five is mailing address and so the list goes on you can add custom subtypes as well so let us see what subtypes are stored for this employee so we'll go in overview so here this column is subtype column this is the start date of the info type record this is the address description telephone number and the second address line so we'll view this subtype okay. so this is the subtype 1 permanent residence and this is these are the details filled by the employee so permanent residence subtype includes these fields care of street and house number second address line city province postal code telephone number and the type so we'll check the next subtype which is stored for this info type that is addresses i'm selecting this subtype 4 and i want to view this so address type that is subtype 4 is emergency address and these are the details which are filled so you can also create more subtypes using the create option here so in case you have to create a subtype you click on subtype and you select the subtype here and click create so these fields are mandatory the one with checkbox are mandatory fields you have to fill those fields and then you can save this record So I hope you have understood what are subtypes. So the subtypes are the infotypes are divided in different groups linked to the same theme. So these groups are called subtypes. So the example which I showed you was for infotype addresses. That is six triple zero six infotype. Thank you. Please subscribe to my, to my channel.